What is going on guys, David Braga back here with some more news uh, for the first time in a while. And uh, I gotta say, this one is really baffling to me. I, <laughs> I, I don't even know how to explain this one. Um, so you, you can see right here, a uh, fan could be banned for life after sneaking racist symbol onto TV. Now, I know you guys can obviously see the symbol right here. But uh, when, I, when I first saw this article, I thought, you know, maybe he put up a W with his fingers before the Cubs actually won, right? Because the Cubs whole thing is fly the W. Maybe he put up a W when Chris Bryant went up to bat. Maybe he put up a W after they took the lead at some point during the game. I don't know if they had the lead last night before the walk-off. But, you know, maybe he put up a W at some point. Or, you know, like fly the W. Maybe it was something like that. And then, like, maybe you could have an argument, right? Like, maybe... Maybe that's a white power thing. Maybe we can investigate this. But he does the OK symbol. <laughs> you see, he does the OK symbol or the the circle game, which I think is the dumbest thing ever. He does. What? This is. Look, if this is racist, if this is a racist symbol right here, then then lock me up, <laughs> like. Like, I, if this is a racist symbol, then everybody that I know is racist. Because everybody that I know has at some point done this. Uh, it, just everybody's right. Okay. So, Bleacher Nation, site that I really, really enjoy. Fan flashes the OK sign behind Doug Glanville. Cubs are investigating because of possible racist connection. This is a good article. This is a good article. You guys should check out Bleacher, Bleacher Nation. Check out this article. It talks about... Um, how it's the okay sign, it mentions the circle game, it mentions how it could be written. Like, this is a good article, I really like Bleacher Nation. But some of these people are just, just absurd when they talk about, don't be a racist trash at that Cubs fan. Like, this is, this is a bad tweet. This is a bad tweet. Cassie, I'm, I'm following you, this is a bad tweet. This is a bad, bad tweet, Cassie. Don't be racist trash at that Cubs fan. You're not even assuming. You're not even taking into consideration any other possibility. You just see that symbol and you just think, oh, this person is racist. I mean, give me a break. Uh, Chicago Sun Sun's Time investigating an incident when the fan uh, appeared to use a racist gesture. Didn't even mention anything else. Didn't even mention. New York Post. Cubs fan could be banned for life after sneaking racist symbol onto TV. I mean, the... I mean, this is just stupid. This is just stupid. A, a white power symbol at a Cubs game. Classic racist Cubs fan. I, I don't even. What does this even mean? Like they're in Chicago. What, what does this even mean? Uh, GM Kevin Cross expressed this uh, disappointment regarding the racist hand gesture last night's broadcast. We find that behavior of this fan reprehensible and clearly does not represent the great. Cubs fans of our city and those in this country. So let me show you the uh, let me show you the the video here. Um, no sound, obviously. I don't want to get like banned or anything. But here you can see Glanville is uh, is doing like a like an in game thing, an in game uh, sort of broadcast. And uh, he just drops the, he just drops this. It's not a very long thing, and then they they cut away. And I, it just it just baffles me that people people are taking this as a rate. Wait, I may be ignorant on this. How is this race? No, you're not. Ig you're not ignorant, Chad Brocho Cinco. It's not ra ra racist. No, Tr triggered SJ. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that. Yep, that makes sense. Uh, so Crane Crane Kenny, the uh, the uh, the Cubs president, says team isn't buying the circle game line of reasoning. I actually haven't seen this, so we're gonna we're gonna read this one together. We're gonna we're gonna take a look at this one together. Uh, Cubs said they're investigating. Uh, it was making a, an on-air report during the Marlins has been associated with white nationalists and right-wing trolls in recent years. Exactly! Right-wing trolls. So even if this was a racist, I'm doing that air quotes, racist thing, it's a, it's a troll. Ignore the trolls. Has that not always been the thing? Has that not always been the, uh... Oh my goodness. Has that not always been the advice? I just... Such ignorant and repulsive behavior is not tolerated at Wrigley Field. We are reviewing the incident thoroughly because no one should be subjected to this type of offensive behavior. Any derogatory conduct should be reported immediately to our, bar to our ballpark staff. Yes, I agree. 
If it's actually racist or actually derogatory, you should report it. I... <laughs> I don't understand how... Oh, look, guys, I just I just did the white power on YouTube. Somebody banned my channel. I just... I don't understand how this is... Somebody... Somebody in the comments, one of the, like, three of you that watch these videos, somebody in the comments, please explain to me how this is racist. How this is a derogatory... How this is a derogatory symbol. How this is racist. Okay. Oh, white power. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm guessing this is racist now. Uh, yeah, so this was during a Boston Bruins thing. He does it right here. Is was this being was this being investigated? I heard nothing about this. I heard nothing about this one. This is during this is during a Boston Bruins, probably one of the playoff games recently. I'm guessing this is racist thing now. That's what Cub fans are saying. Unbelievable. So I I don't even know this person. This person must be saying that this is this is was this investigated? Investigate this fan Bruins. I I cannot believe that this is being investigated. If this if this fan if this fan gets a lifetime ban for doing this, I don't I don't even know what to say anymore. I I really don't know what to say anymore. It I, it's just it's unbelievable. I remember I, I can remember a time so I played baseball from little league up to middle school, and I remember coaches giving me this symbol when I got a hit, when I stole a base, when I scored a run, when I when I recorded an out, when I threw a guy out at first. I, like this is, I coaches do this all the time. My parents do this all the time. Like okay, good job, or you know, like middle schoolers and little kids now play this as like the the circle game, which again, stupidest thing I've ever heard. But it's a game. Even if this is racist, it's a trolly thing. Ignore the trolls. That's the easiest way to deal with it. If this fan gets a lifetime ban, you know what this precedent is going to set for fans across the country? Look, the Russell Westbrook thing, I didn't even hear all, all about that. But if those two, if Russell Westbrook and that fan are going back and forth saying stuff and this fan's being racist, like, directly to Russell Westbrook, fine. So be it. Ban the guy. Like, that's, I think it's on Russell to be a professional about it. But that's, that's just my opinion. Fine. Ban the guy. But this is absurd. This is just stupid. This means nothing. This means nothing. I Let me know down in the comments what you guys have to say. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like. It helps out a lot. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe for more, uh, more content. Hopefully it's better than this trash. Like this, this trash article um, and, and content. Um, and I'll, I'll see you guys next time.